Inside the show CSI this Thursday night, he's won four Emmy Awards for his writing. And you can see him every Friday on VH1's Best Week Ever. Give it up for one of the comedians I grew up watching it, and I absolutely love to continue watching. One of the funniest guys I know, Greg Fitzsimmons, is here. Give it up. Yeah! Good to see you. Thanks for coming out tonight. This is, uh, L.A. needs this show tonight. L.A. keeps pretending that it's got morals, that somehow all the porn isn't made here. Like, like we're good and we're clean. They just made a zoning law. You can no longer have a strip club in L.A. that's near a school or a church. Like, somehow, if a man's in a strip club, he's getting worked up. He's dangerous. He's so horny. He's out of control. When he comes out that front door, it's like... Just kids diving into bushes and jizz flying through the air. I'm sorry, but that is not how a man leaves a strip club. It's more like, shit, I hope nobody sees me. That ass. And that bald spot. Look at that shit. It's my 42nd birthday today. I just, uh... really scream you're getting older like like my taste in porn yeah that's what I just said asshole if you're gonna come up with a heckle don't rehash something I said nine seconds ago and then throw a fucking gang sign you pussy dude you're not big enough to be in a gang you're like a caddy for a gang member you just wipe their balls when they're done raping now shut the fuck up There are 8,000 people, they want to hear what fucking Manny from East L.A. has to say about each of my jokes. Let me, let me keep stopping down to address your fucking inane comments, you douche. So anyway, I turned 42, and I'm finding that my, my tastes in porn... <laughs> Do you know that fucking guy? Is he in, is he in your gang of losers? So I have a... Uh, yeah, I am. I'm losing my fucking hair and I'm proud. I don't give a shit. I'm married. I'm not gonna take... I'm not gonna be one of these guys in L.A. that just keeps, like, uh, taking pills and sewing shit into his head. You can take a pill called Propecia. It's so dangerous, they warn you on the commercial, if your pregnant wife touches the pill, your child will be born deformed. Like, how selfish do you have to be? Fuck them. Look at my hair. Your kid grows up, Hey, Daddy, you have nice hair! Oh, well, thank you, son. Now get back in your tank before your gills dry out.